Hello friends and welcome to Virtual Tech Box YouTube channel. Today's video is in continuation with the last video in which we had deployed the Nutanix Community Edition on the VMware Workstation. You can click on I button on the top and go to the video in which we had installed the Nutanix Community Edition on the VMware Workstation. Today we will do, do the basic settings on, on that cluster and we will install the Windows virtual machine on it. For demonstration purpose I will deploy the Windows 7 virtual machine but you can follow the same steps for installing the Windows 10, Windows 2016 or Windows Server 2019. For any version of the windows the steps would be the same for the installation i will require two isos one is windows iso and one is nutanix word iso nutanix word io iso download link i will provide you in the description i will first log into my cluster by the cvm ip 192.168.0.62 I will provide the CVM credentials I have logged into my cluster. I will first give the name to my cluster. Save. Then I will go to settings. I will provide the NTP server name 0.pool.ntp.org. Add NTP server added. I will go to network configuration. Create network. Lab network. VLAN ID 0. Save. Network created. I will now go to image configuration under the setting. And I will upload the ISO which we will be using for creating the Windows virtual machine. Upload image, I will give the name here. Image type ISO container I will keep the default I will give the path to the ISO save
it is uploading the iso file Windows ISO upload completed and image has been created for the Windows ISO. Now I will upload the Nutanix Word IO ISO. Upload image. ISO container I will keep default upload file it is uploading the word IOISO Nutanix work IOISO upload also completed. Now I will go to VM. I will I will go to table and I will create the new VM. I will give the name. I will select here time zone vcpu 1 4 2 memory I will give here 3 GB we have one empty CD ROM I will go to edit then drop down here I will select clone from image service first type I will keep ID and here in drop down I will select the windows ISO update now I will add one more CD-ROM I will go to add new disk I will select here CD-ROM type I will keep ID add now I will go to second seed ROM edit clone from image service and on the image option I will select the Nutanix word IO update now I have to add the hard disk I will go to add new hard disk type disk allocate on storage container SCSI default container I will give the size here 10 GB add the last thing network adapter add new NIC and I will add my uh, network which uh, I had created lab network add you can see here nick has been added save vm has been created i will make the vm power on I will launch the console
windows installation inside the vm has started it is loading the files Next, install accept license. Next. custom you can see here it is not showing the hard disk available because we need to upload the drivers and for this purpose only we had connected the second cd-rom which is nodanis word io so i will go to load drivers browse I have pick here hide drivers that are not compatible so this is the word io iso i will expand it i will go to uh, you can see here uh, version wise folders are there i will go to windows 7 I am having 64 bit ok it is showing me the 3 uh, drivers I will press ctrl and select all and I will press here next It will now install the drivers and will show the hard disk available for the installation. After loading the drivers, it is showing the hard disk available. Advanced, new. apply ok I will pause the recording here and will resume once this installation is completed installation has completed in the virtual machine I will give the username next I will set the password for my username I will confirm the password here
नेक्स्ट यूज रिकमेंडेड सेटिंग्स आई विल सेलेक्ट माय टाइम जोन हियर नेक्स्ट इट हैज टेकन द आईपी एड्रेस फ्रॉम माय डीएससीपी आई विल सेलेक्ट होम नेटवर्क and here operating system installation and in newly created virtual machine has completed if i go to start and open the command prompt and i will try to ping google.com i am able to ping the google.com which means my virtual machine is able to reach the internet so here we have successfully installed the operating system windows operating system in the newly created virtual machine over the nutanix cluster likewise you can install the uh, operating system uh, in any of the windows virtual machine it may be windows 10 windows server 2016 or windows server 2019 i will wrap up my video here i hope you like this windows vm or nutanix cluster video like and share the video subscribe to channel i will see you in the next video thank you